some election stories now. Board Chairman of the National Peace Council, Dr. N.S. Edujimfi, has called on stakeholders in Ghana's elections to foster trust among themselves as the country heads to the polls in December. Dr. Edujimfi added that these mistrusts have often led to tension and considerable violence in every election since the beginning of the Fourth Republic. The following report has more. Speaking at the inauguration of the Committee on the Code of Conduct on Vigilantism and Elections, Dr. Eduenchi said the issue of vigilantism that characterized the 2020 elections posing a severe threat to the country's democracy and hopes the newly inaugurated committee will ensure it does not recur in this year's elections. Since the Fourth Republic, all elections have seen mounting tension and considerable violence. There is mistrust among stakeholders in the election management system. This is not healthy for our democracy. Our objective as the foremost peace-building institution in Ghana is to have a political environment that is characterized by consensus building and a political system that has the capacity to address differences at any time such differences may arise. This is because protracted election-related disputes gives us cause to worry, as insurgents are always lurking around to use our vulnerabilities for their nefarious ends. NDC's Director of Conflict Resolution, Abraham Amaleba, who represented his party, said the committee instituted by the Peace Council is a good step towards the free and fair elections. Mr. Amaleba indicated the new code of conduct will serve as a self-regulatory mechanism to guide the party in ensuring the successful conduct of the December polls devoid of violence and the use of vigilantism. With this initiative, Members of the political parties will be required to play in accordance with the code of conduct. We as a political party would then have to educate our members on the code of conduct. So from here, I would go back to the party headquarters and initiate a move to educate our members across board. MPP's Director of Finance and Administration, William Yamoa, said his party does not have any vigilante group and will also abide by the new code of conduct on vigilantism and elections. William Yamoa indicated that the MPP has confidence in the security agencies and will not involve vigilante groups in the 2024 elections. We believe in the institutions of this country and that is the police service the military or the Ghana Armed Forces. We don't believe in um, any um, groups of people who act as uh, vigilante groups or security. Um, and I want to take you back a bit. We recently had our internal elections and then we gave the entire security activities. We entrusted everything to the care of the police. And then there was no incidents or chaos or uh, violence related um, incidents at any of the centers. So if even our own internal activities, we entrusted the security operations to the care of the security, then that should give you the assurance that NPP believes in the institutions of this country. All the parties present pledged your commitment to a peaceful elections in December. Kenneth Jesse's report read to you.